Chatsuite is an open source customer engagement platform. And it's more or less an alternative to other platforms that you know, like um, Intercom and others. Um, Chatsuite is a better way to reach out to customers, manage um, conversation, build relationship, and um, ensure uh, you have a one place chat all through for your staff working in the company. So they have the documentation as shown in my screen where you can make a direct request to their API. And um, you can also range in from the user collection to account creation to the agent boards. They have all documented API with also a response um, samples where you can integrate them seamlessly. React is a UI JavaScript library for building user interface. And it's more or less a way of you making, creating interactive UIs, making your view more simpler, and also ensuring you have um, easy flow of components based architecture in your application. Here is my code sandbox account. So I'll be creating a code sandbox, a React application code sandbox application, um, a React application on code sandbox. So it can either be um, any front-end application like that's React, uh, Vue.js, or whatsoever uh, front-end that can be deployed as a static page application. So creating a new sandbox, now why am I creating a new sandbox? This is just like to stimulate the process of creating your React application locally. So let me create a React application. <clears throat> so as you can see on my screen, I have my React application live already. So this is what we actually need, this URL here. So this actually stands, or let me say, represents the um, your actual URL of your application. So we need this to easily tell chat suits where um, each point to or where you're actually integrating it into. So if you don't have an account, then you can easily just create your account here on chat root. But because I already have an account, so as you can see underneath, you can see this university administrator. So if you don't have an account yet, you can just more or less like signing up. When you sign up, you get a email notification, you verify your account and you, you are ready to go. Creating a demo, that's inbox, a new inbox. Inbox it simplifies that, uh, for example, if I have different websites and I want to make use of chat on all these sites. So I can create several inboxes that faces um, different sites. So it can be a site, it can be um, Facebook, it can be um, WhatsApp, it can be Telegram. So in that case, I'll have multiple inboxes. So this inbox, I can assign inject. If I have uh, 50 to 100 people working for my company, once I spin up the company, I can, I can easily add them into this inbox. So for example, if site A, is focused on um, probably um, human resource management, then I can assign people from human resource management to that particular application where they can respond to chat. Then if it is focused on um, maybe the finance department and we have a subdomain, so I can integrate a chat, a live chat with chat with on that finance um, subdomain application, then I can assign people from some, um, a finance department. So, I'll click on this button. I click on add inbox. You can do that by clicking on, let me just go back this point here where you can click on add inbox. So you see the option to choose channel. So as of today, October 1st, uh, we have integration, um, integrating chat with the websites, Facebook, Twitter, Quilo, email, messaging, API, and Telegram, and SMS, also via Twilio. So, but in this case, we'll be choosing um, website because of course, our React application is a website.
um, we get to see where we can insert the website name. So the website name can be anything, and just anything you could think of that is associated to your website. So let me just say, um, okay, have the yeah demo. So now I have my name set up. So this is where you enter the website domain. So this, the domain I copied earlier for my code sample, which simplifies, which directly points to my React application, is what we make use of here. So now I've placed my domain. You can decide to um, select a co color, color type, anyone that suits your company or that matches your company color code. And also, you can also set up hello here. Yeah. This is more or less a welcome header that they get to see after integrating that's and when anybody lands on your on your site and this is the first thing more or less like a welcome message can be anything and uh, aside that you can also extend it by adding more tagline to welcome them by saying um anything maybe welcome to uh have your react demo so in this case um they get to see this after this is more or less setting up how our chat um our chat suite manager will look like on our website so you can get to set up everything here they want to set up this is another option for enable channel greetings you can decide to enable channel greetings but then you type in and you can decide to disable it for now I'll disable it and um we we'll click on create inbox